all right so we have a lot of good news and this is that update video there's update number four for helmet trick let's get started First of all, I am so excited to announce that we are getting into the final stages of the software. So basically, um, anyone who's interested in buying can actually buy now. So I've made the software a little bit more, a little bit less buggier and have ensured that whoever is trying it out has a very clean experience. So the Helmetry project is powered by WLAD, it's open source library. So alongside that, I have modified it in a way that it's more easier to use with just the local area network. So it works on Wi-Fi. So you don't need to disconnect your Bluetooth devices or anything as such. It directly connects to your smartphone and you change the settings. I'm pretty sure no one's riding with their uh, Geo hotspot in their bag. So that's like a one rare thing where you'll have to disconnect from your Wi-Fi. Other than that, if you're on your bike, you'll never use your head. Um, what do you say, Wi-Fi? Right now, I haven't completely finished the battery prototype. I mean, we are working on it pretty continuously. Me and my business partner are working. I have got a business partner, that's right. His name is Murli Krishnan. So he is helping me out with the manufacturing process, ensuring that all the components fit together and that are up to manufacturing standards. It's a lot of hit and miss run. So right now, what we have for you is a proper demo piece, a proper finished look of how the product will actually feel like in your hands once it's done. So this is a wired prototype, basically. So I'm gonna put on the GoPro right now. Room's a little bit messy because I haven't exactly planned this video and I don't have the best gear, but I'm still gonna try you guys, try to give you guys the best view possible, all right? So basically, uh, switching over to the GoPro, this is the beautiful masterpiece. It's an empty affair helmet, and um, it is of a client from Bangalore. His name is Mr. Abdul. He is grateful enough. He told me that you go ahead, buy a new helmet and do it for me. So as you can see, the pattern is what we are following. The graphics on the helmet is what we have followed for designing. Right now it's powered by a power bank and it connects via normal micro USB cable. So if you have a bike charger, you're good to go. If you don't have one, get a power bank, keep it in your bag. Uh, keep it in your bag. Bang, wow. So this is running a pallet uh, transition right now and it looks beautiful and gorgeous. I'm not sure how to stress this, but it is pretty darn bright and I'm, I think I've put it to 70% brightness, it's not even up to full. There are lots of patterns you can choose from. Right now I'm gonna head over to the laptop and just show you guys another pattern which is uh, beautiful and there's this police pattern which looks kind of cool and uh, this is a 50% brightness, oh my god. So put it up to 100 and that's the full brightness. I mean, it's still limited because I don't want it to consume a lot of power. These LEDs are hungry for power and they're not exactly battery friendly. So I'm just trying my level best to find the balance between the best brightness, the best performance and the duration it can run on. So these things are work in progress. As you can see, there's no wires inside the helmet. It is completely, completely clean. And that's beautiful. Actually, I, I really want to show you guys how it looks um, when it's turned off. So I'm going to turn it off right now. Give you guys a better look. So this is how it looks when it's turned off. I'll bring it closer to the light so you guys get an idea. This is exactly the finish you'll be getting. So right now we are working on a few things. We're trying to cover up the LEDs and make them diffuse because that involves a little bit of manufacturing. We are kind of stuck up with that. Other than that, it's pretty much a beautiful finish. It is water resistant, not waterproof. You don't want to go diving with this guy because I don't think anyone goes for diving with the helmet, but I would wonderfully try that one day from a prototype so i would make them waterproof and try that's a heads up for how it looks there are a few patterns which i want to show you so basically we have a new pattern that is called flow if i'm able to find it uh, i'm bad with my alphabet so a f comes before yeah there you go fireworks and we got flow so this is flow it is a beautiful pattern there's a pattern running right over there so that is a different type of uh, pattern that's called, I think, Fire Flicker, I'm not sure. But this is called Flow. It's a beautiful pattern. There's literally unlimited options. Like if I go into, let's say, um, let's say you're going on Independence Day ride, okay? And people do that, trust me. People do that and it's a very fun thing to do. So when you go for Independence Day ride, you're like, you know what, I'm a patriotic person. I need them colors, bro. So I'm gonna give you an option of changing it to, uh, let's say, Red, uh, orange, saffron, basically white, and then we go for green. So now we switch to colors only, and voila, we have a helmet that's completely ready for the Independence Day ride. I don't know if this is beautiful or just amazing, 
but i can't get enough of this there are times you just tell this as and as just wondering what can i do next to improve it so yeah this is the update on how the helmet has progressed so far so keep the helmet aside and turn on the gopro now next up business so basically all of this needs money and money is not something that comes unlimited i know all of you are like eagerly waiting for me to release it there is a lot of financial things that you keep in mind to release a product the demand to meet the demand i really need a lot of funds to get along and this is a project which i started from my personal pocket so that is a bit heavy because if 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 i get more than like 10 customers at a time i'm going to have a tough time getting the raw materials so i've started a patreon page where you can have a tier subscription uh it is 5 dollars a month for the beginning and then you get you can upgrade to 10 or however it is you get exclusive support you get um, custom designs you get uh, the know how of how it works i'll help you on making your own so this is basically a way to fund myself um i'm not sure how many people are going to even sign up for it it's a very small channel i'm having but i have a big dream of making everyone safe on road and that is the ultimatum of this project i want you guys to be a part of this dream and there's no other way than helping me financially i i really sound like a beggar but i'm not i really want to get this out there we are partnered with another helmet showroom called rainbow this is for you people in chennai so i've brought in some samples from their most selling products i mean it's not exactly a dot certified helmet but then yeah i brought these helmets just so that i could make them led and make them let basically with leds and this is the uh, this is a thunder model this is called the air 2 and these two are like one of the most selling helmets from um, steelbird series there is iso uh, isi model so i'm not exactly a big fan of them but yes they do protect your helmet head compared to a half face helmet or no helmet at all and the mask they do do the mask part too so this is going to be fitted with leds very soon and going to be displayed in rainbow showroom helmets in germany at germany flyover chennai you can go try it out by yourself it's coming week end probably by the time the video is uploaded it's going to be the next weekend so not this weekend the next weekend so yeah you could try out and change the settings and see how it feels like for yourself i mean if you like it and it's your thing go ahead place an order it comes directly to me over here and i fix the leds and you get it after a few days it's simple as that so this is a testing phase too because there are still feedbacks coming in i thought a battery would be a very big hit but it seems that all the 20 clients i'm having 27 of them want a wired one and that is a very interesting number because i thought people wanted to be wireless it turns out that people don't want to charge their phone helmet and their you know headphones and everything it's just a big mess so they're like i don't want to charge a lot of stuff and i want you to add on to that list bro so i'm like cool i got you fam i'm going to make a very good wired version with no limitations basically go full on brightness but the legal thing so basically there are helmets with already leds coming out in the market there are there are like ones that have uh, the flashy ones i'll show you that too once again this module is from a sol helmet it has triple a batteries two triple a batteries in it and it does nothing but um, turn on flicker i mean i think this would be called blink this would be a rapid blink and then that's it the cycle mode and it has just three patterns whereas we have quite a lot of patterns and 16 million colors okay add these variables alone okay let's do a probability thing how many patterns can you possibly make there are 255 levels of brightness there are 255 levels of speed there are 255 levels of effect intensity there are 16 million colors a possible led on this helmet can make alongside that you also have 86 plus patterns for every human on this earth there is one unique pattern i mean i think i i think numbers are even even greater than that so you don't need to worry about running out of patterns or becoming bored of the helmet because every day is a new day and you're going to go in style this is my product and this is what i want to get you guys and i want your support making sure that this this comes amount of support i've received is tremendous i'm grateful to every single person who has supported me in this um alongside that i would also like to thank whoever has already purchased the pre-orders uh, the prototypes and uh, this is one this is the the prototype basically um prototype as in there are still some gimmicks here and there to be fixed but yeah that's pretty much it it's pretty much a stable release and um tree so uh, give me 3 months time and i can assure you you can get your hands on these guys completely 
as of now if you're fully interested you can hit me up on patreon or you can hit me up on my instagram follow helmetry at helmetry and you can leave me a message why you're interested and i will make sure that you get what you want prices are going to be a bit more expensive in the prototype stage because it's in low numbers please do understand that whoever is interested but yeah that's pretty much it for the update and yeah um, i haven't taken much b-rolls or anything uh, i haven't done a shoot properly because i've been very busy with the whole session of reprogramming and flashing it and testing the optimal settings apologies on that from my end but yeah that's pretty much it for this update video stay tuned there's a lot more coming and thank you if you like this video please do leave a thumbs up and if you like my content subscribe it helps me out patreon links are in the description if you want to go check that out thanks peace out